travel through the game of Xianxiao. Wei tirelessly was forced to cross the Qingya mountain for 800 years. 800 years of heavenly thunder washing the body. Qingya mountain has become a forbidden zone for everyone's life when they hear it. Wei retiredness has also become a taboo life in the rumored cultivation world. I have completed this work, I really didn't target Fei, and have ordered over 10,000 yuan. The quality is guaranteed, so please feel free to taste it. Keywords of the novel 800 years of crossing the tribulation, I have become a taboo life without a pop-dot-up window. 800 years of crossing the tribulation, I have become a taboo life. Complete download of TXT 800 years of crossing the tribulation, I have become a taboo life. Latest chapter reading. Chapter 1. Starting the Crossing of Robbery. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 1. Starting the Crossing of Robbery Luoxianzhu. Qingya Mountain. A small path in the mountain views the sky above. At this moment, there are dense clouds. Spiritual beasts and birds have long smelled the free electric wires in the air and avoided them far away. Only a silly rabbit plunged into the vegetable garden in the backyard of the Taoist temple. Just haven't waited for it to uncover the white radish it's been longing for yet, sting. After the thunder. A faint fragrance of meat wafted from the Taoist temple. Across from the vegetable garden is a small pavilion. In the pavilion. A handsome man dressed as a scholar sat upright and in a precarious position. But there was no joy in his face of waiting for success. On the contrary. His eyes were visibly dull, Lei Yuan's immortal Dharma practice launches. In the 930 year of the spirit wasteland realm, on the first day of April, you began your journey of crossing tribulations. Estimated remaining time. 23, 58. 30 on 364, 799, current heavenly calamity. 9 sky fire and thunder calamity, the thunder emperor's talisman is in effect. You are immune to 99.9999% of the damage from the 9 heavenly fire thunder robbery, boom. A fiery thunderball wrapped in flames hit Wei Bu tirelessly on the forehead. Only a slightly dry hot breeze blew. It's like someone lightly tapped the forehead. Wei tirelessly instinctively touched the back of his head with his hand. It's okay. The short-cut hairstyle that I just spent $30 on yesterday was not affected. It took three minutes. His gaze finally changed from dull to calm. Time travel. And it's also time to travel to a single-player Xianxia game I'm currently playing. Wei Bu tirelessly remembers very clearly. Before crossing. He was following the guide found on the forum, using a large account to painstakingly brush out 60 fragments of the Thunder Yuan Immortal Law to form a set. He also stayed up all night pulling and flirting with the female celestial demon of Tiendi Mountain until dawn when he finally obtained the legendary immortal artifact, Lady's Talisman. He just sent these two things to the newly opened account through Flying Sword Transmission, ready to experience the pleasure of hanging up for 800 years and becoming immortal. Suddenly, my eyes turned black. And now it is understand the causes and consequences. Wei Bu is a bit numb. The 800 years in the game are just a matter of returning from a day's work in the evening. But now boom. It seems to be due to Wei's tireless and indifferent attitude. The cloud suddenly began to erupt. Seven lightning balls the size of bathtubs fell in a row. Thunderbolt ignores dead objects. The pavilion and vegetable garden are in peace. Wei Buki himself also has the support of the Thunder Emperor's talisman. Just pitted the nest of ants at his feet, a few earthworms, and a centipede. Instantly melted into ashes. Wei tirelessly let out a light sigh. Then disregarding Jiayun and continuing to ponder. The good news is that this technique becomes stronger when struck by lightning, and I don't even need to practice it. As long as I lie down and hit, it's done. The bad news is that for these 800 years, I may have to be alone with Jian. No phone. 
No Wi-Fi. No cola. Is there only a day after day, hot and cold-tempered heavenly robbery mother? Weibu tirelessly couldn't help but shiver. But soon he wanted to open it up, the world of cultivating immortals is so dangerous. My small account only has the strength of refining gas at level 3. Going out and running around requires a lot of effort to find techniques, resources, and Taoist priests to take care of how can there be a natural increase in the comfort of lying flat under the calamity of heaven. But 800 years. It passed in a blink of an eye. At that time, he cultivated himself into a fairy. There is plenty of free time. That's right, I've already traveled to the cultivation world, I'm not as lazy as before. If you have the ability to change your destiny, why not work hard? Besides being struck by lightning, I should also take the initiative to cultivate something myself. After clear-mindedness and determination. Wei Bu tirelessly seemed to suddenly become enlightened. He enthusiastically focused his gaze on the character panel. Name. Wei Buki, Shou Yuan. 1644, short-lived species, race. Human race, congenital. Root bone 45, plus 1, slash understanding 66 slash fortune 80, the day after tomorrow. Qi 46 slash 5 senses 71 slash beauty 78, cultivation. Refining gas level 3, practice. Thunder Yuan immortal true technique, unique binding, spell slash magic slash tool. None, achievement. Initial test of heavenly calamity, new, initial test of heavenly calamity. The first intimate contact with heavenly calamity, the heavenly thunder washed the body, and it was incredibly comfortable. You have received a reward of, root bone plus one, be well behaved. Surprisingly, he is a top-dot-notch character with almost perfect luck and beauty. Wei Buter didn't even pay attention at that time. This character needs to be placed in the game. Even if you don't practice the Thunder Yuan Immortal Dharma. If you take two steps out of the mountain, you may encounter a high-dot-level fairy who requests to become a Taoist couple. There are many licking dogs who send wealth, medicine, and martial arts to the cave. The downside is that the bone is too poor and it is also a short-dot-lived species. Even if it means going soft and eating hard. The accumulation of resources all the way may reach the limit of Yuanying. During the transition, it is inevitable that hundreds of Taoist priests shed tears as they bid farewell to their own reincarnation, creating a poignant scene think about it this way. Indeed, being struck by lightning is more suitable for oneself. The Thunder Yuan Immortal Dharma treats everyone equally. As long as it can withstand the thunder. Even the worst bone can point straight to the main road. Wei Bu tirelessly calmed down. Click on the unique binding technique. There are indeed a variety of spells, supernatural powers, and treasures below, palm thunder. A cluster of thunderous flames covering the hand, shaking the ears in all directions, cultivable, five dragon skill. Five fingers transforming into dragons, electric light and fire stone, cultivable, Qianyang Ichi sword. A mouthful of true yang energy, pouring rain all over the sky, can be practiced during the foundation period, palm thunder. Just you. The first time actively practicing a technique. Wei Butard has a strong sense of freshness. Not long ago. He immersed himself in it. However, what he didn't know was. The character he traveled through was not the owner of this Taoist temple. Outside the Taoist temple. A simple dressed Taoist with a neat bun asked naively. Master, master. Why did you suddenly hug me and run out? The hunched old Taoist next to him gasped for breath and said. That's thunder and fire. If you stick to it, you'll be completely scared. This little bunny is really not particular. I see that he looks white and clean, and his clothes are also of good quality, so I think he is a wealthy young man from a wealthy family and somewhat cultured. I only agreed to his accommodation request last night. Who knew it was actually a cultivator who silently attracted Jia Yun? 
If it weren't for my master running fast, the two of us would have to be with the furry rabbit in the backyard. The young child sucked his nose as if he had not heard it. The thief's eyes spin fast. Master, master. There's a meat aroma. The old Taoist laughed in silence. He looked at the exterior of the Taoist temple for a while. Then he took the hand of the little Taoist and walked down the mountain. This heavenly calamity cannot stop for three to five days. Fortunately, it should not destroy our objects. I think the person who crossed the calamity should be a righteous person in the midst of thunder and clouds. Maybe I misunderstood him, maybe he didn't mean it, maybe he was too young, and suddenly he had a sudden impulse that led to Jayan. The old Taoist thought to himself. But when the young man successfully navigates the calamity, we still need to remind him one thing. Ayuan, you also need to remember. Whether it's cultivation or doing things, don't be impatient. The child nodded. Then he looked at the Taoist temple with reluctance. Let's go. Let's stay overnight at Jingyan Temple. The old Taoist patted the child's head with a red light on his face. Master, Master. Is it inappropriate for us Taoists to stay at the nunnery? The Taoist said seriously. As a practitioner of our generation, we should have been detached from the world. Who cares about those idle words and gossip? Besides, if you don't say, I don't say, or nuns don't say, who would know? The old Taoist glanced at him askance. Or do you talk nonsense everywhere? Dao Tong suddenly shook his head like a tambourine. No, no. The old Taoist snorted. Pick up the child and leave. The latter was carried by the old Taoist in his hand. Struggling like a chick, shouting. Master, master. I have one last question. What if this calamity cloud doesn't dissipate all the time, what will happen to our Qingfeng temple? The sound gradually faded away. In the blink of an eye, the figures of the master and disciple disappeared from the mountain path. Only the laughter of the old Taoist drifted along the mountain wind. Ha ha ha. No one crosses the tribulations every day. Mengxin seeks recommendation, collection, and reading. End of this chapter. Chapter 2 Don't want to work hard anymore. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Chapter 2 Don't want to work hard anymore. After a night of hard work, your palm thunder experience plus two, the next day. Wei tirelessly opened his eyes. Outside the walls of the Taoist temple, there is a faint morning light. He even had dew on his eyelashes. Unconsciously, I spent the whole night practicing. I really don't know the years. Wei tirelessly felt emotional. The feeling of cultivation is wonderful. It's irresistible. The feeling of being fully immersed and clearly feeling oneself gradually strengthening is truly wonderful. He is a bit in love with cultivation. Boom! A lightning ball crossed the pavilion cover and hit his neck. He yawned. Looking up and rushing towards the cloud, he waved to indicate good morning. Get up and move your muscles and bones. Wei Bu tirelessly suddenly felt empty and hungry inside. That's right. Valley cannot be opened before the foundation construction period. Although he can absorb the spiritual energy of heaven and earth to fight hunger now. But ultimately, we still have to eat. It's okay. I have prepared enough Pai Gu Dan in my bag. Wei tirelessly played with the space items carried around his waist. The use of games and reality is completely different. He studied for a while. Only then did I proficiently grasp the tricks of the switch. This is just the most basic Chinkuan bag, with an interior space of only 3 feet square, but it is enough for low dot level cultivators to use. He checked it yesterday. In addition to the 20 bottles of 400 pieces of Pigu pills, there is also a Xientian sword sect ascension order, a map of the Qingya mountain area, a novice flying sword, for bottles of low dot level qi in blood revitalizing pills, a qi refining guide, three inferior spirit stones, 
two sets of laundry clothes, and a light red silk screen in the bag. The rest are standard for beginners. And Pigu Dan and red silk screen were transferred from the larger side. The former is a daily consumable material that can be used for more than 30 years, and is enough for the character to cultivate several times until the foundation period. The latter is called Luo Qing Net, which is an evil weapon used by disciples of the Six Desires Demon sect to seize the Seven Emotions and Six Desires of Mortals. This thing is also used to fight against the Heavenly Calamity, but not the Thunder Calamity, but the Heart Demon Calamity that may occur in the later stage. Think of it here. Wei Bu is somewhat regretful. If I had known earlier, I wouldn't have been lazy. According to the instructions in the guide, Luo Qing Net is a lower level replacement for another immortal artifact of the same level as the Thunder Emperor's talisman, the Soul Breaking Pin. This thing can also fight against Heart Demon Robbery. But the effect is definitely not as simple and rough as that of Soul Saber. Unfortunately, after finishing his liver, the protective talisman of Emperor Lei, Wei Bu tirelessly, couldn't withstand it anymore, and he no longer had the desire to go to Fengdu Mountain to reminisce with the female king of Yen. If I had known early on that I would have traveled. He wished he could take off the big pants and put them on the small ones. If I had my large Qianquan immortal bag in my hand. Hey! Wei tirelessly closed his eyes in pain. Can't think anymore. If you think about it again, the demon will come smelling it. He swallowed a pie gu dan. After a brief rest. Heat flows out of Dantian. An unprecedented sense of fullness swept over my heart. Get it done. There will be no need to eat for the next thirty days. Wei tirelessly adjusted his mentality. I quickly immersed myself in the diligent cultivation of the magic palm thunder again. After four hours of hard cultivation, your palm thunder experience plus one, in the afternoon. Wei Butard suddenly woke up from his meditation. He glanced at the progress of his cultivation. Not bad although it's a bit slow. But victory lies in endurance. The upward trend of the experience bar is also very stable. According to the current cultivation speed. In two to three days, he will be able to cultivate this technique to the level of beginner. That is 10 experience points. Although the higher the proficiency of the technique, the higher the experience value required. But Wei Bu tirelessly doesn't care. He has plenty of time. He is not pursuing instant pleasure. But the feeling of gradually becoming stronger through one's own efforts. Think of it here. Wei Bu tirelessly felt his whole body hot and dry, as if he had an inexhaustible power. He wished he could immediately regain his composure and continue his cultivation. At this moment. On the first day of crossing the tribulation, the heavenly thunder washed the body and refined the heart with true fire. You feel like you have become stronger. Passive reward. Your palm thunder experience plus 100 active reward. Please select, 1. Magic tools 2. Technique 3. Danyao 4. Lingshir 5. Networking, can networking also be rewarded? Wei Bu tirelessly was surprised. But what shook his mind even more was the passive reward. He took a look. The experience bar of Palm Thunder instantly changed to 103 800. Good guy. The proficiency level skipped the beginner level directly. Becoming proficient. He tried to rub his palm with thunder. The technique is exceptionally skillful. The next moment. A bright light flickered like daylight. Then came a deafening explosion. Tear it off. A thunderbolt the size of a thumb began to beat in Wei's tireless palm. After counting the breath, it disappeared and disappeared. Hmm. Very white. Very bright. The sound is also loud. But it doesn't seem to have much power playing with palm thunder for a while. Wei tirelessly wiped away the tear marks on his eyelids. Started considering rewards with complex emotions, 
scratch off the magic tool directly. Under the heavenly calamity, magical tools have almost no place to be used. Weibu tirelessly kept a careful eye on Jia Yun when using the bag. Afraid of being damaged. The technique can be considered. Let's start with things like Tianyantong and Shuanfenger. Can alleviate boredom. Danyao is not necessary. The cultivation of the Thunder Yuan Immortal True Method naturally increases, and there is no demand for elixirs. Unless it is an innate elixir. The type that can improve innate attributes. But this possibility is extremely unlikely. Not to mention the Spirit Stone. Being struck by lightning every day. There's no place to spend even with money. As for the last item Wei Butert couldn't help but feel a movement in his heart. You have chosen a network. The network module has been enabled you have obtained the Cloud Collection Heavenly Creek Flowing Cup Bottle Asterisk 1, you open the Flowing Cup Bottle and obtain the Letter from Gusha Mountain People, Good Guy. Isn't this a drifting bottle from the cultivation world? Wei tirelessly said it was strange. Why haven't you found this feature in the game before? He clicked on the letterhead. Instantly speechless, Gu Shi Shan Ren. Is anyone there have you received a targeted reply after reading the letter from Gu Shi Shan Ren? Note. Daily initial reply is free. Afterwards, there will be a charge of one lower grade spirit stone every ten times Wei Bu tired was startled. Dare to feel that the spiritual stones all over my body add up to only enough to consume thirty times. I was deceived. Wei Bu tirelessly imitated the ID on the opposite side and replied casually, lying mountain man hmm. Anyway, it's free of money. Power should be a pastime. Unexpectedly, a few minutes later. Network. You replied to the message from, Gush's Han Ren and Gushes Han Ren's favorability towards you has increased. Current favorability. 61, does that give you a good impression? Wei tirelessly felt even more inexplicable. He noticed in the social network. The portrait of Gushes Han is a question mark. Surprisingly, there are two Taoist avatars below, one old and one young. Zuan Zenzi, for floors of foundation construction, Current favorability rating of 59, Dao Tong Ayuan, not yet practicing, currently has a liking rating of 65 who is this with? Wei Buter didn't think much. Close the contact bar. He perked up his spirits. Return to the cultivation of spells. I want him to work hard on Palm Thunder. Experience can only be rubbed up bit by bit. Passively struck by lightning but it is improving day by day. It is impossible for him to say without any ideas in his heart. But Wei Bu tirelessly felt that he might have chosen the wrong direction for cultivation. Perhaps the palm thunder is not suitable for me. Perhaps I have more talent in practicing other spells. Soon. He set himself a new goal, five dragon skill. Get up. In the blink of an eye, it will be nine days later. After nine days of hard work, your five dragon skill experience has increased by nine on the tenth day of crossing the tribulation, the heavenly thunder cleanses the body and the true fire cultivates the heart, making you feel stronger. Passive Reward 1. Your palm thunder experience plus 1000, current proficiency is exquisite. 1103 slash 5000, Passive Reward 2. Your five dragon skill experience plus 450, current proficiency is 459-1000, active reward. Please select. In the pavilion. Wei tirelessly patted his cheek, feeling a bit tired. The huge gap between self-cultivation and passive rewards made him start to doubt life. It's broken. I don't want to work hard anymore. What should we do? Outside the Taoist temple. Zuan Zenzi, holding Dao Tong a Yuan, had a serious face. It's been ten days. What kind of calamity did this kid get through? Could it be that the old man glanced away and realized that he was a master of the golden elixir? This is to promote him to the Yuanian position. Boom. 
suddenly, a fireball the size of a pavilion cover fell from the sky. There is also a thunder dragon with teeth and claws hidden in the ball. The old Taoist instinctively shrank his neck. Pull up a Yuan and run. Stay at Jinyan Temple for another two days. End of this chapter. Chapter 3 Xuanxuan Demon Cult You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 3 Xuanxuan Demon Cult Active Reward Please select, Magic Tools Slash Spells Slash Elixirs Slash Spirit Stones Slash Connections, you have chosen a spell, you have obtained the, Wanchi Technique, Mastery Level, Wanchi Technique. It can roughly judge the fate, cultivation, cultivation methods, and origin of others' Wanchi Technique. A fairy tale version of the appraisal technique for each protagonist in ancient online game novels. Wei Bu tirelessly feels pretty good. Unfortunately, there is no one around. It seems to have little use for it. He tried to cast a glance at the dark coke next to the fence in the vegetable garden, wind chasing rabbit, already dead, electrocuted. Before his death, he was a spirit beast in the Qi refining period. He was agile and skilled in controlling the wind, and his fur could be used to make a universal flying spell tool called Wind Chasing Pen during the Qi refining period. He is suspected to be a pet of a disciple of the Chaotic Spirit Sect. Chaotic Spirit Sect. No impression. Wei tirelessly learned a new technique that made his hands itch. Glancing fiercely at things around him. Unfortunately, there was no result except for that lump of coke. He regretted for a while. Then came a sudden idea. A wave of anger emanated from the three people in the social network. Gusha Mountain Man failed to hope for Chi. Suspected to be blocked by the Mountain Gate Protection Formation from the Heavenly Machine. Zuin Zenzi. During the period of Foundation construction, male, 67 years old, a disciple of the inner sect of Biswi Mountain Villa. He practiced the method of external alchemy and was a master of alchemy. Due to his ambiguous relationship with a nun, he voluntarily left Biswi Mountain Villa and established his own Qingfeng Temple on Qingya Mountain. Wait! Wei tirelessly patted his thigh. The place where my pavilion is located seems to be Qingfeng Temple. Although Jian only attacked my side, the entire Qingfeng Temple was covered. It's broken. This old and young Taoist will not be killed by themselves, will they? Wei tirelessly has a heart full of grievances. But on second thought. Since there is still a display of their favorability in the social network, does this mean they are still alive? If one really dies because of oneself. I wouldn't have such a high level of favorability, would I? Moreover, that little Taoist has a relatively high level of familiarity with himself. Once you think about it. Wei Bu tirelessly calmed down a bit. Keep looking down. Iun, atmospheric fortune teller. A mortal, male, four years old, the youngest son of General Tianwei of the Jade Dragon Kingdom in the secular dynasty. His family was implicated in the Crown Prince's rebellion and was executed by the entire family. He is the only survivor and now lives and cultivates with Zuanzenzi. Innate destiny, Grandmaster, purple. There is a high chance of growing into a prominent figure in the cultivation world who established a sect. Turning danger into safety, purple. There are three opportunities in life to escape from dire situations, remaining times. 1. People in the mortal world, green. Destined to be entangled with the mundane world, experiencing ups and downs throughout life, countless murders and tribulations, and even more so, making it difficult to escape after reading it. Wei's eyelids twitched tirelessly. It should be noted that innate destiny is almost a reflection of a person's life. Few people can escape from fate. And there is a distinction between high and low levels of destiny. Distinguished by the colors detected by the technique of looking for qi, from low to high are seven levels. Gray, white, blue, green, purple, red, and gold. The more precious life a person possesses in their destiny, the happier nature leads. 
a multitude of living beings. The three major innate destiny traits are mostly gray and white. Occasionally having a blue one is considered an elite. Green destiny can be called the dragon and phoenix among people. Purple is even more a destined nobleman. And this child, a UN. One person occupies two purple and one green fates. He is a truly atmospheric athlete. Unfortunately. At a young age, A Yuan's destiny has been used twice to turn danger into safety. Wei Bu tirelessly has a clear understanding in his heart. The first time it must have been used by him to escape from the mundane cases of plagiarism and execution. The second time may be to survive the calamity brought by oneself. Although time travel is not under one's control. But it was also a man that made disaster caused by oneself. Weibu tirelessly felt somewhat guilty towards the little Taoist in his heart. Guilt seems to be of no use. I am currently trapped in a heavenly calamity and have no choice but to do something. I hope they stay away and don't come back again. Wei tirelessly let out a light sigh. His current range of activities is only near the pavilion. Go further. It will stimulate Jian to enter the rampage mode. Although the Thunder Emperor's talisman is in his hand, he is not afraid of the heavenly robbery mother coming to his aunt. But there are many variables in crossing the river. It's best not to cut corners and grow new branches. At present. He adjusted his state. Continue to diligently cultivate the five dragons technique. Wei Bu is not tired yet. He told himself. Maybe I just haven't found the secret to practicing martial arts. Maybe if you find the trick, your cultivation speed will reach thousands of miles in a day. Ultimately, give up on yourself now. It's too early. This time, I need to work harder for a little longer. Wei tirelessly entered with high fighting spirit. Another ten days. Outside the Qin Feng Temple. Under a green pine tree growing on a stone wall, stood a charming middle-aged nun, an old Taoist with smiling eyebrows and eyes, and a little Taoist with sparkling eyes. Three people stand side by side, like a family of three. It's been twenty days. This kid has survived twenty days of calamity. Is it possible that he is a Mahayana cultivator? When can I return my Taoist temple to you? Looking far ahead at the clouds of calamity. Old Taoist Xuanzhen's expression was complex. Within the territory of our Jade Dragon Kingdom, the highest recorded cultivator in history is only a primordial baby, and the transformation of gods only exists in legends. How could a Mahayana cultivator be willing to hold on to your broken Taoist temple? The beautiful and plump nun's red lips lifted lightly, and her words were quite straightforward. This calamity cloud is frozen but not dispersed, extremely abnormal. Did you provoke some enemies outside and they came to find fun? Listen to what she has to say. The old Taoist immediately explained with a bitter face. I have already explained to the female cultivator of the flowing cloud sect clearly. The golden fairy of the half mountain sect cut off contact nine years ago, and I have also rejected the two disciples of the flowing flower sword sect many times. The nun still smiled dignified. But the gaze gradually became sharp. Zuan Zenzi quickly changed his tone. If we were to say that there is indeed an enemy, you also know about the incident in Jinsi Valley three months ago. I had some grudges with an elder of the Xuanxuan demon sect over that 100 cent herb. But he only has a cultivation similar to mine, how could he possibly deceive you and me? Besides, using deception to play tricks on enemies is not the style of Xuanxuang demon sect. The more he said, the more he became puzzled. The nun's face was also full of doubts. She glanced at Zuan Zenzi and suddenly chuckled lightly, saying. You come to see if the Jian has dispersed every day. I don't think it's because you're worried about your broken Taoist temple, but because you're afraid that people from the Xuanxuang demon cult will come and seek revenge. If you run into that young man who has just completed the Jian and is weak, I'm afraid he might be killed by poison, right? Zuan Zenzi's face turned red. 
You actually noticed it. The nun spat. You have a tough mouth and a soft heart, and this is not the first time I have seen you. The old Taoist laughed heartily. He pulled up the drowsy hand of Ayuan. At this point, we can only rely on that Taoist friend's own destiny. Let's go. Let's go back to Jinyan Temple. The backs of the three gradually faded away. Laughter occasionally appears in the mountain breeze. A few more hours passed. The sky is getting dark. A dark red light suddenly flew from the northern sky. The light cluster has a dark color. Far away, it looks like a red cloud. Stay up close and take a look. But it's a human-sized blood cocoon. The blood cocoon circled around the Qingfeng Temple twice. A little bit. A short and thin man with a shrewd look in his eyes emerged from the blood cocoon. He landed outside the fence in the backyard of Qingfeng Temple. Peeked for a while from afar. The man's eyes flickered incessantly. Someone crossed the robbery. Impossible. Zuan Zenzi wasted many years in the middle of building the foundation. Even if he obtained the 100 cent grass and made some breakthroughs in cultivation, it was only in the later stage, far from crossing the tribulation. I haven't heard that Zuan Zenzi has friends who are close to crossing the tribulation. He pondered for a moment. With a sudden sneer. Who did he cross the calamity? When the clouds of calamity disperse, I will catch them all in one fell swoop. Once you think about it. The man found a foothold on the back cliff. Sit still and regulate your breath. However, this sit in. Another ten days have passed. Ten days later. The man gazed at the refreshing view of white walls and grey tiles from afar. The eyes became increasingly surprised. Is Jiayun still here? The Nine Heavens Fire Thunder smashed down like it didn't cost any money, it's been ten days. Even if it's someone I teach, it's impossible for them to receive such treatment. Is that so? Is it a cover-up? This thought cannot be contained together. The man couldn't help but approach slightly. He is still very careful. There was no significant approach. Just didn't wait for him to take two more steps. Mingming is still about fifty meters away from the range covered by the cloud. The Jiayun, who usually only bombards the pavilion, suddenly takes a turn in attack, sting. A thunderbolt traversed across heaven and earth. Poor man, he only managed to grasp one-tenth of his escape technique. People have already lost their souls and spirits. You have killed the elder Lu Ziyuan of the Xuanxuan demon cult, and his relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you. You may face their pursuit. Hate level list is being activated ah. Wei tirelessly watched the sudden news. There is a deep confusion in my eyes. Did I kill someone? End of this chapter. Chapter 4 Hate Ranking you are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 4 Hate Ranking Hate List, 1. Ji Lienyo, in the early stage of building the foundation, current hatred level. 102. Lu Feiyang, in the early stage of the Golden Elixir, current hatred level. 99.3. Jiang Xiaoyuan, Qi Refining Level 7, current hate level. 94. Summer Bridge, in the later stage of foundation construction, current hatred level. 8929. Empress Wei, in the later stage of foundation construction, current hatred level. 64 Good Guy. This inexplicably added 30 enemies in one breath. I was stunned to see Wei Bu tired. It is important to note that a hatred level of 90 or above is considered a deadly blood feud. I won't say anything else. The top three people will definitely go to great lengths to seek revenge on themselves. But the key is, I didn't do anything. Wei tirelessly hurriedly got up. He looked around in confusion. There is no abnormality within the range visible to the naked eye. He opened his qi watching technique again for a round of inspection. 
I just found that vast charred corpse outside the backyard wall of Qingfeng Temple. Lu Ziyuan, already dead. Before his death, he was an elder at the Yongzhou branch of the Xuanxuan demon cult. He was skilled in the blood cocoon demon technique and came to seek revenge due to a dispute between a hundred Qian grass and Xuanzhen Zi. However, due to his karmic power, he angered the heavenly calamity and was killed by a thunderbolt. Its status is not low in the Xuanxuan demon cult. After death, the lamp of immortality will be extinguished, and the Xuanxuan demon cult will inevitably respond way is tireless and speechless. Why did this guy just die like this? And what's the matter with me being killed by the heavenly robbery? Jie Yun is not owned by my family either. Causing enemies for no reason. He is still a bit unhappy. If there is a big world and small speaker function. He wished he could publish ten such contents to the world in a row, strictly inform Elder Lu Ziyuan that he passed away due to a porcelain disaster, and his death is not related to himself. At this moment. Several messages flashed by. You have killed a highly karmic member of the demon cult, and his karma will be converted into your merit. Merit module enabled, current merit count. 93 convertible merit props. None, you have achieved the achievement of eliminating demons and defending the way, eliminating demons and defending the way, new. It is our duty to eliminate demons and eliminate demons. You have received a reward of strength plus one, how dead. Wei tirelessly lifted his spirits. Merit is a good thing. It will be of great use in the future. Just one Lu Ziyuan provided himself with 93 merits, which shows that he had multiple karmic powers before his death. He took a rough look at the introduction using the technique of observing Qi. This blood cocoon demon skill actually requires the fresh blood of daily cannibals to be cultivated. It can be seen that this Xuanxuan demon sect is definitely a despicable evil sect. It's not worth cherishing 10,000 deaths in this kind of sorcery. Anyway, I have a heavenly calamity to protect my body. Who dares to approach the evil people of the demon sect? Wei tirelessly thought for a moment. I also felt relieved. He looked at the charred corpse with some regret, under the thunder of the sky. Lu Ziyuan's soul is shattered, that's all. Along with his pills and magical tools, they were also completely destroyed. There were several spirit stones scattered on the ground. Unfortunately, he can't find it at this moment. Speaking of heavenly calamity. It seems to be due to the stimulation of Lu Ziyuan's karmic power. The frequency of nine sky fire thunder falling has become even denser. Boom. 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 Three consecutive lightning balls hit Weibu tirelessly on the forehead like a gust of wind and rain. He touched his scalp. It's hot. The heavenly calamity is really terrifying. Weibu tired yawned. Start using the Wangchi technique one by one towards the people on the hatred list. After one round. Exhausted and exhausted. But Wei Bu tirelessly felt a little more relieved in his eyes. It's okay. There are no particularly powerful atmospheric runners among the enemies. The most prominent character among them is Lu Feiyang, the son of Lu Ziyuan, Lu Feiyang. In the early stage of the Golden Elixir, male, 44 years old, an elite disciple of the Qingming demon sect, practicing the supreme magic, great azura immortal skill. Life History Lu Feiyang was sent by his father Lu Ziyuan to the holy land of Qingming demon cult in Beishan Kingdom since he was young, and he never left afterwards. Although Lu Feiyang is not familiar with worldly affairs, his cultivation of magic is poisonous and his karmic power is extremely heavy. After learning of his father's death, he will definitely not give up. Innate Destiny Born demon, green. Born to be an evil demon, practicing magic techniques is twice the result with half the effort. Cultivation and inheritance, blue. Both parents are cultivators, and there must be a miraculous way of inheritance. Drunk madness, gray. After drinking alcohol, one must become obsessed. After becoming obsessed, 
one becomes extremely bloodthirsty and disoriented, with a very low chance of breaking through to a higher level fortunately, I have a heavenly calamity to protect myself. Wei Bu tirelessly understands. Although Lu Feiyang's destiny is far inferior to Ayuan's. But among ordinary people, they are already dragons and phoenixes. I won't say anything else. The 44-year-old Golden Core Realm is enough to demonstrate how suitable this tusk is for practicing magic skills. This is a formidable enemy. As for the other two in the top three of hatred. That male disciple named Jiang Xiaoyuan should be Lu Ziyuan's closest disciple. He only has seven levels of qi refining. But he has a strong desire for revenge. It indicates that the relationship between master and apprentice is relatively deep. There are also several disciples of Lu Ziyuan behind. But the level of hatred is generally only around 70. This value is approximately, if you hit it, have the ability, and are in a good mood. Then you can easily seek revenge. A positive mindset. As for the top-ranked, Ji Lianyo. Wei tirelessly learned that she was Lu Ziyuan's concubine. With the help of Lu Ziyuan, the foundation was successfully built this year. Previously, Lu Ziyuan and Xian Junzi had a dispute over the hundred coin grass at the local auction. It is also for the former to consolidate Ji Lianyo's cultivation. It seems that these two people are truly in love. At the very end of the enemy list. That woman named Empress Wei. She is Lu Ziyuan's first wife and also Lu Feiyang's biological mother. But this woman should not have much relationship with Lu Ziyuan now. After her husband's death, her hatred level was only 64 I'm afraid if a cat or dog dies at home, it's better than this. Fun and interesting. Read through the information of these people in one breath. Wei Butard seems to have finished watching a big gossip show. The Qi technique is showing. These people are connected by lines, forming a crisscrossing network. Most of the lines are gray. The representation relationship is unknown. A few display different colors and have text annotations. Wei tirelessly savored it with relish, Xia Qiao, who ranks fourth in hatred, is Lu Ziyuan's iron buddy. He is a leftist cultivator who was taken care of by Lu Ziyuan before embarking on the path of cultivation. His relationship with Lu Ziyuan is usually the strongest. 89 points of hatred is not low, indicating that their relationship is true. But the question is, how could this guy have a romantic relationship with Lu Ziyuan's wife, Wei Feifei? The relationship between my elder brother and sister. In. Law has faded. Can you help to clear it up? Lu Guiyuan, ranked 28th, is the law enforcement elder of the Yongzhou branch of the Xuanchuang Demon Cult. He has recently competed with Lu Ziyuan for the position of deputy sect leader. Lu Ziyuan's death actually made him very happy, but due to his position, he must be held accountable. There is also the vengeful disciple Jiang Xiaoyuan who seems to have a crazy obsession with his master Lu Ziyuan's concubine Ji Lianyo. Your circle is really chaotic. Eat melons until they are full. Wei tirelessly feels refreshed and refreshed. In summary. The only person who looks like a character is Lu Feiyang. Fortunately, this person should be out of town now and won't be able to come back for a while. Wei Butard still has a sense of crisis. What if the people in this demon realm have a means to block the heavenly calamity? Although I haven't heard of it myself. But I can't stand it in case. It seems that we still need to work hard to cultivate ourselves. I casually knocked on a Pai Gu Dan. Wei tirelessly closed his eyes to rest and quickly fell asleep. The next day. Yongzhou Lufong Mountain Valley. Xuanchuang Demon Sect Branch. There is a lot of noise in the deacon hall. For a while. Someone shook the scene. Yesterday, Elder Lu's longevity lamp went out. I believe everyone knows this news, right? A spirited silver-haired old man pretended to be sorrowful and said. The lamp soul finally pointed to Chinya Mountain. What do you think? End of this chapter.
Chapter 5 Does Jinjia also have a period of fatigue? You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 5 Does Jinjia also have a period of fatigue? Since an elder has died, I have my own regulations and can do whatever I want. A beautiful woman wearing a big red coat and revealing half of her crispy chest lazily replied. She is Lu Ziyuan's original wife, Consort Wei. The silver-haired old man glanced at her and said solemnly. Wei Shimi's words are not accurate. Senior brother Lu has a deep reputation in the sect, and many disciples have received his guidance. Now that he has died inexplicably, let alone others. As a law enforcement elder, I must find out the truth. Consort Wei immediately frowned and winked at the silver-haired old man. Elder Lu has a heart. Since that's the case, I, as an immortal, will thank you on behalf of my husband. Her move. Suddenly, it caused a stir in the hearts of the deacon hall. Even a foundation-building cultivator like Lu Guiyuan, who has a strong sense of determination, cannot help but feel restless. As for the disciples during the qi refining period who followed the audience. It is also a surge of qi and blood that is difficult to self-control. Cough. This is what it should be. Lu Guiyuan reluctantly withdrew his gaze. By the way, should I inform nephew Fei Yang about the robbery of senior brother Lu? Speaking of son. It's rare for consort Wei to become serious she shook her coat and collected the snow.white tender meat. No need. My husband valued Fei Yang the most during his lifetime, fearing that his talents would be buried in the small place of Yongzhou. That's why he was sent to the Holy Land for cultivation. Now it's unclear who caused my husband trouble. Spreading messages recklessly may actually hinder Fei Yang's cultivation. Once Elder Lu finds out the real culprit, I will personally inform Fei Yang. Lu Guiyuan twisted his beard. So, let's first investigate who caused Brother Lu's harm. Dare to confront me on the land of Yongzhou, humph. I will make that real culprit beg for life, not death. He clapped the board and said. I will personally lead the team to Qingya Mountain. Could you please ask Sister Gu and Junior Brother Zhong to accompany me on this trip and select six elite disciples? After a moment. Lu Guiyuan shouted for everyone's help. Just in case. He also requested the deputy cult leader to take out a magical treasure called the Red Flame Blood Wheel from the secret treasury. This magic weapon has great power. It is also easy to backfire on the owner. Even idle cultivation cannot suppress it. Lu Guiyuan also ordered the three cultivators named Jianji to take turns in charge, which gave them the opportunity to control this powerful magical weapon. A group of people are ready to set off. Not far from Lufong Mountain. I bumped into Ji Lianyo, who was dressed in plain clothes, and Jiang Xiaoyuan, who followed her with a submissive but firm gaze. Lu Gui saw from afar the pitiful appearance of Ji Lianyo. Recalling the charming figure of Empress Wei again. I couldn't help but curse in secret, Lu Ziyuan's good fortune is not shallow. Although Ji Lianyo is not a member of the Xuanxuan demon cult. But everyone knows that she is Lu Ziyuan's little room. Seeing her eager for revenge. Perhaps she followed along the way. At noon. The group of Xuanxuan demon sect arrived at Qingya Mountain. The road is far and the eyes are sharp. I can see Jian from a distance. Immediately, his face changed drastically. Stop. It's a heavenly calamity. Did senior brother Lu die from crossing the calamity? People in the demon cult are most sensitive to heavenly calamity. They know that the flames of evil will surely be punished by heaven. Therefore, they rarely take action during thunderstorms. Not to mention offending thunderbolt. Lu Ziyuan won't say anything. The others also stop their steps from a distance. Among them, Ji Lianyo is the most vengeful. She anxiously watched for a while, shook her head, and said. Ziyuan's fate is far from over, this is not his fate. 
returning far is also a doubt. He and Lu Ziyuan are enemies. We know each other's roots and bottom. That guy is still 108,000 miles away from the crossing robbery. How could he have been struck by lightning at this time? Perhaps someone else was crossing the tribulation, and Master accidentally passed by and got into trouble. Jiang Xiaoyuan murmured softly. It's possible. Lu Guiyuan frowned tightly. But senior brother Lu shouldn't be so foolish, right? Strange. This matter is strange. The others looked at him one after another. The other two foundation building cultivators clearly have a retreat intention. But the road is long and I don't want to go. In the morning, I boasted loudly that I wanted to avenge Lu Ziyuan, but in the afternoon, I withdrew and went back to say that he was killed by the heavenly calamity. Who would believe it? Consort Wei may make a wish letter. But her son definitely doesn't believe it. And this matter must be handled beautifully. Otherwise, if the position of deputy leader is vacant at the end of the year, it won't be my turn. At present, he pondered and said. If things are abnormal, there will always be demons. Senior brother Lu is not a fool, as everyone knows, so we must investigate how he died. Even if senior brother Lu is really implicated in someone else's heavenly calamity, we must kill the person who crossed the calamity to avenge him. I think this heavenly calamity seems like the calamity of a righteous disciple. How about this? Let's wait in the distance, wait for the calamity cloud to disappear, then we will take down that disciple and ask clearly, how about it? The other two foundation building monks exchanged a glance. In the end, I sold my way back to Yuan to save face. They found a foothold on the back cliff. Sit still and regulate your breath. After twenty days of hard work, your five dragon skill experience plus twenty the thunder Yuan immortal true method. In the first month of crossing the calamity, the heavenly thunder cleanses the body and the true fire cultivates the heart. You feel like you have become stronger. Passive Reward 1. Your palm thunder experience plus 2000, current proficiency is exquisite. 3103 slash 5000, Passive Reward 2. Your 5 dragon skill experience plus 900, current proficiency is exquisite. 1379-5000, Active Reward. Please select, detected that you have mastered two exquisite level techniques with the same root and origin at the same time. Do you want to integrate Palm Thunder with 5 Dragon Skill since they are both of the same origin and can merge with each other, why did they practice separately from the beginning? Wei Butard felt strange. However, out of curiosity, he still clicked OK. After fusion, you have obtained, spell. Five dragons true thunder, five dragons true thunder, exquisite level slash cannot be improved. You can activate thunder elements through your palm and five fingers, and can shoot up to six lightning rays to kill enemies. He took a look. After fusion. Palm thunder and five dragon skill still exist separately. It's just an additional, five dragons true thunder, that cannot improve proficiency. Three techniques. Wei tirelessly tried one by one. Palm thunder is still a pit father as always. This thing is a model of thunder, rain, and small dots. A loud voice can shake people to death. Sneezing is better than being less powerful. Unfortunately, it will also create serious light pollution. Weibu tirelessly gave up practicing it for this reason. The five dragon technique is quite useful. This is a practical skill that falls between palm and finger techniques. Once this technique is activated, Wei's tireless palms will be accompanied by a layer of lightning. Hand speed will also increase by several levels. It's a pity that this hand speed isn't used for XX. Feeling the charm of flying hands. Weibu tirelessly deeply regrets. As for the five dragons true thunder. It looks quite impressive. Wei tirelessly reached out his hand. Then a bright white power grid can be opened up. It can attack enemies up to three meters away. 
the geometry of damage is difficult to estimate. But it must be Wei Butireless's strongest attack method now. Anyway, I finally have a way to defend against the enemy. After practicing several times, Wei Bu tirelessly became proficient in sending and receiving. This is just a little reassuring. As for proactive rewards. This time he still chose the spell. The Qi technique I touched last time was very useful. Wei Buki naturally won't easily change categories. You have chosen a spell, you have obtained the spirit bottle, transformation level, spirit bottle. Consuming half of your mana, you can create a bottle that can hold all things. Note. During the existence of the spirit bottle, you will continue to consume your own mana transformation. What a high level of proficiency. Wei Bu tirelessly beamed with joy. The proficiency level of spells, from low to high, is divided into six levels. Beginner level, proficient level, exquisite level, transformation level, profound meaning level, and great way level. Exquisite level spells can often unleash combat power beyond their own realm. The transformation level technique is even more powerful. Unfortunately, it seems to be an auxiliary type. Wei tirelessly tried immediately. But when it comes to making bottles for the first time, he feels a bit awkward. Either the bottle mouth is widened or the depth inside the bottle is narrowed. It took half a day. He just pinched out a bottle with a satisfactory shape. Weibu Tireless Spirit Bottle, Foundation Building Level Can be used to nourish pills and immortal herbs, can be used to store souls and spirits, can be used to collect thunder, rain and dew. Wei tirelessly felt a movement in his heart. Inject some mana into the spirit cylinder. Take a photo into the air through the bottle mouth. In no time. A feeling of fullness came from inside the bottle. Spirit bottle. You have ingested a set of nine sky fire thunder. Wei tirelessly overjoyed. Although I've been exhausted for this bottle. But it's worth it. The Nine Heavens Fire Thunder is much stronger than the Five Dragons True Thunder. This is a lightning spell with a hint of heavenly authority. What kind of monsters? A Nine Sky Fire Thunder descended. I'm going to lose my soul. Another practical weapon. Wei tirelessly calmed down his mind. The more you look at the majestic Jayun, the more pleasing it becomes. However, just as he was pondering whether to create more spiritual energy bottles to collect the wool of the heavenly robbery. The free electric wires in the air suddenly disappear like receding tide. Thunder you on immortal dharma. The heavenly calamity has entered a three-dot day period of fatigue, during which the cloud of calamity will almost disappear thinly, and your range of activities will also expand. Does heavenly calamity also have a period of fatigue? Wei tirelessly enjoyed himself. Coincidentally, he has been practicing hard for a month. Getting up and moving around is also good. At the same time. On the back cliff. The apocalypse is over. Let's go. Lu Guiyuan shouts out an order. The members of the demon sect bravely killed them. End of this chapter. Chapter 6. Don't come again. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 6 Don't Come Again. Qingfeng Guanho Mountain. Ten or so Dao Dun Guang came quickly. Among them, Ji Lianyo and Jiang Xiaoyuan were the most vengeful and rushed at the forefront. Lu Guiyuan and others are not inferior to each other, everyone wants to take down the person who crossed the tribulation and achieve the first achievement. Only junior brother Zhong, who was named and accompanied by Lu Guiyuan, was the most astute. After hearing the command to return to a distant destination, he charged the fastest at the beginning. Can fly. Unexpectedly retreated to the very end of the team without realizing it. Whoosh. Ji Lianyo has the fastest body method. Overpassed the wall in one breath. She saw Weibu tired moving his muscles and bones in the pavilion at a glance. 
The latter was also surprised to see a woman dressed in mourning and with sharp eyes suddenly appear on the wall of their backyard. It's broken. Someone is seeking revenge. Wei tirelessly instinctively grabbed the spiritual bottle. Take your life. Ji Lienyo's willow eyebrows stood up, and suddenly a ghostly fan appeared in her hand. However, before she could sacrifice the fan, a crack suddenly tore open in the sky. Boom! First, a faint blue pillar of fire tore apart the heavens and earth like a sharp axe. Next up. It's an endless rain of fire falling. Wei tirelessly has a tingling scalp. He saw it very clearly. The pillar of fire pierced through the body of the woman dressed in mourning from top to bottom. Just this one. Ji Lienyo was burned to the ground, leaving only a few charred bones scattered from the air, stumbling on the wall a few times, and finally falling into the vegetable garden, accompanied by the charred corpse of the windward chasing rabbit. Stimulated by people with deep karmic power and magical tools, the heavenly calamity has prematurely ended this cycle of fatigue heavenly calamity strength upgrading current heavenly calamity. Underworld fire calamity not good. When the pillar of fire falls. The closest thing to Ji Lienyo is Gue Yuan, who is eager to make contributions. Seeing the cloud of calamity disappear and return. The old man was scared out of his wits. He ran out without saying a word, stirring up the escape formula. Barely escaped the first round of fire rain. When looking back. Jiang Xiaoyuan and other disciples in the Qi refining stage have already been ignited by the fire rain. One by one struggled and howled a few times. It became scattered carbon blocks. The road is far away and I dare not stop. Inject all the mana into the evasion method. Just trying to escape. Is Tianjia so easy to deal with? Captured by the robbed cloud. The power of idol cultivators will be greatly weakened. Not to mention targeted magic cultivation. Difficultly avoiding the fire and rain. Lu Guiyuan never felt that his escape method was so sluggish and slow. In order to resist the ghostly fire like a gust of wind and rain. He threw several magic tools in succession. But these magical tools can only counteract one or two underworld fireballs at most. In no time. His belongings were completely destroyed by the heavenly calamity. I see that I can't escape the scope of the heavenly calamity. The road is far away, and I cannot help but feel disheartened. The moment of life and death. He suddenly noticed a figure on the edge of the scope of the heavenly calamity. Junior Brother Zhong. Help me. Lu Guiyuan screamed as if he had caught a life. Saving straw, yes. As long as Junior Brother Zhong can block a few underworld fireballs for me, I can live. He stumbled and ran away. Looking at Brother Zhong, who was almost intact, with hope on one side. However, the latter stands on the edge of the catastrophe. Just looking at me with a cold and indifferent expression. There was still a hint of mockery in his eyes. In an instant. The road is far away, with blood and gas surging up and eyeballs protruding rapidly. Don't save me. Then don't even live. The road is far away, and the madness is rampant. He suddenly offered up the red flame blood wheel, a strange laugh came over. In the crimson demon fire. A demon with blood dripping from the corner of its mouth emerged. It bit off Lu Guiyuan's right arm in one bite. Under the pain of eating, Lu Guiyuan howled repeatedly. Next breath. He used the power of the blood wheel to forcefully stimulate the escape light. Escape towards Junior Brother Zhong at three times the speed before. Seeing this scene. Just now, Junior Brother Zhong, who was still calm and carefree, was suddenly frightened and his soul burst out. He immediately transformed into a blood cocoon. Escape further away. After counting and resting. Jian fiercely expanded a large circle. The fire and rain between heaven and earth gradually dissipated. Replace it. It's a huge golden web. 
on the nodes of these networks. Hanging fireballs as straight as day. Who? The fire net covers the sky and the sun. Just press down a bit. Junior brother Zhong and Lu Guiyuan were both trapped. The demon on the red flame blood will only struggle for one turn. It was melted into ashes by white flames. These two demonic cultivators during the foundation building period have been completely wiped out. Stimulated by the heavy karmic magic weapon, the heavenly calamity has entered a period of frenzy. Heavenly calamity strength upgrading current heavenly calamity. Sun true fire calamity even if the good fatigue period is gone, it's okay. The intensity of the heavenly calamity is so special that it has been upgraded two levels in a row. Weibu tirelessly is like being numb in a haystack. It's so hot. He looked at the continuously setting sun in the sky with some discomfort. The Thunder Emperor's talisman is immune to damage from thunder and fire. It can also weaken the temperature. But the weakened sun true fire still caused him some damage. His skin quickly turned from fair to burnt black. At the same time, a vibrant force was ignited from within him, continuously repairing the scalded skin. Soon, he smelled the familiar aroma of meat Wei Bu tirelessly moved a little. There will be large pieces of burnt skin peeling off his body, revealing the tender baby-like skin inside. Such a round trip for several rounds. Wei Buki had a thick layer of burnt skin around him. The most annoying thing is not this. You have killed the former Qinke Tower female cultivator Ji Lianyo, and her relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you. You may face their pursuit. You have killed Jiang Xiaoyuan, a disciple of the Xuanxuang demon sect. His relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you, and you may face their pursuit. You have killed Gu Xiaoqing, the elder of the Xuanxuang demon sect. His relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you, and you may face their pursuit. You have killed the law enforcement elder of the Xuanxuang demon sect, Lu Guiyuan. His relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you, and you may face their pursuit. You have killed General Zhong, the elder of the Xuanxuang demon sect. His relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you, and you may face their pursuit. Open the list of hate levels and take a look. Ha! More than a hundred people in one breath. Weibu tirelessly has a severe headache. He really doesn't want to form enemies everywhere. Isn't it agreed that people in the demon cult are afraid of heavenly calamity? How did everyone start flying moths to the fire when they got here? The cultivation of demons these days are they all doing this without hesitation? Can you let me quietly navigate through the tribulation alone? Not much time, only 800 years. Wei tirelessly and sincerely prayed. Please don't come again. Then he clicked on the hate list. From top to bottom. Start appreciating your breath. Lufon Mountain. Elders Hall. In just two days, the longevity lamps of the four elders Lu, Lu, Gu, and Zhong at this helm were all extinguished together. The enemy is coming with great force, they are taking a heavy attack. What do you think? A man with half a face covered in earthworm like grooves asked coldly. The Changxing Lantern points to Qingya Mountain, it's hard to say it's not a legitimate conspiracy. The lower part. A white-faced young master shaking a folding fan hummed softly. In my opinion, they are trying to provoke a major battle between the righteous and the demonic. Immediately, someone agreed. Fight as you please. Our Xuanxuang demon cult is in the realm of Yongzhou, and we haven't been afraid of anyone yet. Yeah, yes. Damn those turtle grandsons assholes. The atmosphere gradually became irritable. End of this chapter. Chapter 7 Celestial Killer You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 7 Celestial Killer Hate Level List The initial 20.9 generals have lost nearly 10. 
Among the top three, only Lu Feiyang, the son of Lu Ziyuan, remains. However, the number of new enemies is increasing rapidly. After adding hundreds of new portraits, there are many younger and more advanced generations. There are many notorious individuals among them. Watching Wei tirelessly tremble in his heart and liver. Among them, there are three more members of the Hatred 99 Club, including Lu Qinyao, the daughter of Lu Guiyuan, Li Inghua, the niece of Zhong Dashuai, and Gu Xiaoqing's father Gu Fangren. Lu Qinyao. Building a foundation with nine layers, female, 29 years old, an ordinary disciple of the Qingming demon sect, practicing the magic skill, Gui Shui Bu Er Jinju. Life History this woman has an extreme admiration for strength and a love for comparison. Since childhood, she has been childhood sweethearts with Lu Feiyang. After Lu Feiyang was sent by her father to practice in the holy land of the Qingming demon sect, Lu Qinyao also encouraged her father to use up her family wealth to send her to the holy land. However, upon arriving at the holy land, she realized that her qualifications were low, and her elixir's financial resources were also difficult to match those of her peers. Driven by desire, Lu Qinyao sold herself to a magical giant and made a preparatory cauldron to obtain his elixir and financial support. Finally, she reached the late stage of foundation building. Just waiting to cultivate the golden elixir. She will become a target for recruitment. Lu Qinyao has a cold and thin nature, and at this time, she is unwilling to become someone else's cauldron. She is bound to use her father's death to write articles and leave the Qingming demon sect. She probably won't seek revenge on you immediately. Innate destiny, by all means, blue. Born only for profit, not asking about the means, the survival rate in chaotic times is 100% higher than that of ordinary people water flowing lotus, blue. The lotus is made of bone, water, and skin, giving birth to a pure face, which is extremely easy to win the pity in favor of men. Short-sightedness, gray. Only focusing on immediate benefits, never considering long-term plans good guy. Wei tirelessly suspected that Wang Qi Shu had secretly upgraded himself. Is the information given so comprehensive this time? I almost figured out Lu Qingyao's underwear. But. Why are text messages so long? I don't like to see them without photos. And everything else is not important, most likely they won't seek revenge on me. Wei tirelessly and contentedly looked down. Immediately, he was delighted again, he found that although this madman was considered a master in the later stage of the golden elixir, due to the approaching deadline, he had been locked down more than a decade ago to attack Yuaning. In these years, he hardly walked out and was unlikely to cause trouble for himself. Close up, close up. It's like I've been keeping it closed like this. Wei tirelessly praised the old comrades for their unyielding fighting spirit. Finally, my gaze was fixed on the information of the last person. Gradually. His brow furrowed. Li Inghua. Building a foundation with nine layers, female, 17 years old. She is the first true transmission of the Huaqing sect and practices the secret teachings of the Heavenly Palace, the Jade Clear Treasure, and the Nine Heavens and Ten Earths Wandering Magic Sword Technique. She is the contemporary owner of the Huaqing sect's treasure, the Purple Xiujian. Life. None, obscured by secret methods, innate destiny, congenital sword idiot, purple. Born with a sword embryo in his mouth, he is bound to the sword in this life, practicing swordsmanship takes thousands of miles in a day, and after achieving a small accomplishment in swordsmanship, one possesses the strength to challenge oneself beyond the level. Heavenly Killing Star, Red Killing Star is born, with fear and coldness in all directions. Every time you kill someone, your strength will increase by one point. The more you kill, the faster your strength will grow. Note. The heavenly killer star is born and will inevitably face calamity in the world. The heavenly killer star should be the protagonist of calamity, with the god blocking the killing god and the Buddha blocking the killing Buddha. 
Karmic Entanglement, Gray. Killing sins is too heavy, even for the protection of the righteous path, it is easy to be backfired, the karma is extremely heavy, and idle little ghosts are not allowed to approach Red Destiny. Wei Buki, this is his first encounter. Compared to Li Yinghua's destiny. Dao Tong Iyuan's dual purple and green colors are a bit inferior. I don't know what Li Yinghua is doing now. He is a bit afraid. If this kind of killing star comes knocking on your door. I don't know if Brother Qianjie can cover it up or not. No. You, Li Yinghua, are the true lineage of the righteous leader Hua Qing sect. How could you be related to a foundation-building cultivator of the Xuanxuan demon cult? Wei Buterd was very puzzled. So he focused on the Inghua and Zhong De Shui, and carefully surveyed them along the network diagram. The final result left him speechless, who would have thought that this guy named Zhong De Shui was actually an undercover agent from the righteous Huaqing sect to the Xuanxuan demon sect. This guy was a foreign affairs disciple of the Huaqing sect in his early years. From an identity perspective. He is Li Yinghua's uncle. After sending his exceptionally talented niece to practice in the inner world, he turned around and approved his status as a casual cultivator, blending into the Xuanxuan demon cult. Hmm. Although General Zhong was just a small deacon elder at the Yongzhou branch, he had a relationship with the head of the sect's wife through his sweet words. They practiced together several times, almost happy. Dot. What the words of a tiger or wolf? I'm afraid General Zhong may have been immersed in the gentleness of the sect leader's wife and couldn't get out of the countryside. TSK TSK TSK. Sure enough, General Zhong has secretly practiced the blood cocoon magic technique. He is also very close to the people of the Qingming demon sect, which clearly shows that he wants to become a double dot sided person. Unfortunately, Li Inghua is likely unaware of General Zhong's actions. She only thinks of her uncle's kindness. Therefore, upon learning of the news of General Zhong's death, I will definitely seek revenge on myself. Wei Buki is not actually afraid of retaliation. But rather afraid that this snowball will roll bigger and bigger. If this Li Inghua also dies here. So the people of Hua Qing sect shouldn't be able to sit still, right? This time around. After killing the demon path and killing the righteous path, pull out the radish and bring out the mud. There will always be times when you encounter experts. He is now in a period of quiet development. I really don't want to cause trouble. Unfortunately, the heavenly calamity cannot be actively closed, otherwise I would have been locked down and moved to a place where people are rarely seen. Wei tirelessly shook his head and sighed. Fortunately. This Qingfeng temple was not built in a big city. Otherwise, it would be a sin. You have killed several highly karmic members of the demon cult, and their karma will be converted into your merit. Current merit count. 667 Convertible Merit Prop Bird Attraction Ring, New, Bird Attracting Ring, Foundation Level Magic Tool, Required Merit 500 Function, 1 Carry it with you Inject a small amount of mana to make the bird ring accompany you When encountering a surprise attack, you can actively resist 1.3 times of damage from the middle of building a foundation 2. Sacrifice Inject more mana to sacrifice the bird attracting ring, and at the same time, surround the enemy with a large number of summoning second level spirit beasts called Tingqing Sparrow. In the sacrificial state, the bird attracting ring will transform into a white stream of light that can be used for attack and defense, with extremely strong defense capabilities. 3. Escape Light The bird attraction ring can be used to bless escape light greatly improving flight speed Wei's tireless evaluation is. General Goods He has no intention of exchanging. Slay more than ten members of the demon cult, and your achievement. Defeating demons and defending the Wei has set a new record. You have received a reward of strength plus one, this is good. Although acquired attributes are not as difficult to obtain as innate attributes. But improvement is a good thing. 
This wave of demonic cults provided Wei Bu tireless with a total of two points of strength. This to some extent compensates for his congenital weakness in physical condition. If there were more people coming, maybe he doesn't need to build a foundation and reshape his body to fully exert his strength. At the thought of having the opportunity to transform from a powerless scholar into a strong man with comparable physical strength, Wei Bu tired felt a little excited. If you look at it that way, do you think it's good to have some more people from the demon cult? After reading the news, Wei's tireless mood quickly adjusted back to the state of no waves in the ancient well. Above the head, the sun shone down like it didn't cost any money. This gave him a little pressure. At the same time, he also realized that the scope of the apocalypse had expanded significantly compared to before. At this moment, the dark and dark Jian has already enveloped the mountains in front and behind Qingfeng Temple corresponding. Wei's tireless range of activities has also been significantly improved. From the beginning, we could only move around the pavilion. Now you can walk to the vegetable garden and the corridor. If the scope of the calamity continues to expand, wouldn't I be able to wander around? I was lost in thought for a while. Wei Bu tirelessly regained his composure with the fireball, warning himself, Do you see it? Heavenly calamity works so hard. Why do you rest? This time he chose a brand new physical training method called Wind and Thunder Fist. Wei tirelessly believes in it. As long as you work hard enough, the result this time will be different. At least, we can't lose too badly. Two days later, Western Yongzhou, Yulong Mountain, the hinterland of Emperor Hua Qing. A beautiful and innocent young girl with a strong aura between her eyebrows and eyes emerged from the secret realm. She saluted a row of elders outside in a grand manner. After finishing the ceremony, she couldn't wait to ask others. Master, where's my uncle? End of this chapter. Chapter 8 The Truth About Not Getting Close to Women You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 8 The Truth About Not Getting Close to Women Junior Brother Zhong is on a mission outside, so I won't be able to see you today. A dignified and gentle-looking young woman responded with a smile. Inghua, why did you leave the customs early? The girl kindly touched the back of her head. I don't know either. Suddenly, I felt a little uneasy, and Zi Xiujian also let out three low sounds. I was afraid of something happening outside. Once this statement is made, everyone laughed. The young woman doted on her hair. Foolish child, our Huaqing sect is the first sect of the Jade Dragon Kingdom. What will happen without reason? But it's you, it's time to lay the foundation. You can't neglect it. How are you doing with the Yuching treasure and the wandering demon sword technique? During speech, she smiled and held Li Yinghua's hand. The girl does not doubt that there is him. The two of them laughed and went to the secret realm. Until their figures disappear. The atmosphere present became much more serious. The most average person, dressed in a Taoist robe and with a straight face, is what Li Inghua referred to as the Master Master. Zuan Yangzi, the head of the Huaqing sect. Zuan Yangzi waved his sleeves to persuade his disciples to leave. There were only three people left on the scene. Before Inghua and Zi Xiujian have a similar fate, she cannot know the news of Zhong Shidi's death. Zuan Yangzi said solemnly, Sword cultivation emphasizes the importance of achieving success in one go. Her decision may lead to endless troubles in the future. Inghua is the foundation of our sex competition for the next generation of Tianjiao, and her cultivation progress cannot be interrupted. I believe junior brother Zhong, who is in heaven, will also understand me. The other two nodded silently. After all, the next generation of Tianjiao is too important which is related to the century-old fortune of the entire sect. Anyone sitting in the position of Zuan Yangzi would probably make a similar decision. 
but Brother Zhong's matter must be thoroughly investigated and uncovered. Whether it is the Xuanxuan demon sect that discovers his identity or others' interference, it must be thoroughly investigated. Zuan Yangzi looked at one of them. I'm going to visit Qiulongjing soon, senior brother Jiu. I can only rely on you to personally inspect this matter. Senior brother Jiu looks much older than Zuan Yangzi. The Taoist robe was even tattered and tattered. He nodded at the words and said. I saved it. Yesterday, after junior brother Zhong's soul tablet cracked, I asked Jin Yu to investigate. It's not difficult to track down opponents like those who are scattered and scattered in Qingya Mountain, with a large number of people and diverse voices. I believe there will be news soon. Zuan Yangzi's face showed a rare hint of smile. I am very confident about Jin Yu's affairs. By the way, there's one more thing I need to discuss with you too. The malignant tumor of Xuanxuan demon cult has been entrenched in Yongzhou for a long time. In order to completely eradicate it, we have arranged many things before. Even if it weren't for junior brother Zhong, I feel like it's almost time to close the net. I plan to let her lead the way to eliminate Lufeng Mountain after Inghua Sword cultivates her skills. Wait for him to elaborate on the plan. The other two couldn't help but feel revered. Another young-looking man praised. Senior brother, the leader, is very thoughtful. Yes, except for the helmsman Gongyang Killing, who has some strength, the rest of the members of the Xuanxuan demon cult are all top dot not sharpening stones that are suitable for the training of Inghua. After this war, the Tian Sha star showed its sharpness, and its momentum was unstoppable. The position of Tian Shao is within reach. Zuan Yangzi chuckled lightly and said. So in the near future, we need to privately restrain our disciples and avoid conflicts with the demon cult. Let's numb these demons first and wait until the right time. He he. Obey me. The two of them responded in unison. Someone is trying to use their divine powers to check your identity, but key information has been blocked feeling the prying gaze. Wei Butard suddenly opened his eyes. In the network column. In addition to the list of likes and dislikes, there is an additional subsection called Stranger List. Click on Strangers. There is only one avatar inside. Cho Jinyu. In the late period of foundation construction, male, 31 years old, a true disciple of the Huaqing sect, practicing Tai invisible swordsmanship. Life. None, obscured by secret methods, innate destiny, kind-hearted, green. Kind. Hearted and generous in character, fuse plus five not close to women's colors, blue. Showing no interest in male or female affairs, the cultivation speed is 30% faster than that of ordinary people Zhengdao Zhongren, blue. Possessing a righteous aura, easily targeted by Zhengdao experts and taken back to the gate wall, has Emperor Hua Qing arrived. Wei tirelessly had a rapid change of mind. At this moment, a gentle voice rang in his ear. Don't panic, Taoist friends. I am a disciple of the legitimate sect, Hua Qing sect, and I am here to investigate a small matter. My invisible eye divine ability does not stimulate the heavenly calamity, and I have no malicious intent. I just want to ask you something, please feel at ease to cross the calamity. I'll disturb you when the calamity has dissipated. Wei tirelessly opens the technique of observing Qi. But I saw a righteous and dazzling escape light far away from the range of Jian. Afterwards, it landed on another hill. Although I can't see his face clearly. But the feeling it gives is very moderate and peaceful. The acting style of a righteous master is different from that of a devil's son. I just don't know when he's going. Wei tirelessly let go of his worries. He was not distracted. Continue practicing. A few days passed suddenly. This day. Wei Butard suddenly felt the pressure of the cloud above his head suddenly ease. When looking up. The sun's net of true fire has disappeared. The dark clouds that originally covered the entire mountain are also rapidly converging. Thunder Yuan Immortal Dharma. 
the frenzy period has ended, and the heavenly robbery has once again entered a three-dot-day period of fatigue. During this period, the robbery cloud will thinly and almost disappear, and your range of activities will also increase. Originally, the fatigue period did not disappear, it was just delayed. Wei tirelessly thought to himself that even the heavenly calamity can catch fish. Exactly. He can take the opportunity to explain to the righteous disciples outside. It would be best if everyone could not disturb their cultivation. Between thoughts. That escape light has arrived outside the Qingfeng Temple. Xiu Jinyu is very polite. After a warm greeting outside the door, I asked if I could come in. Wei Bu tirelessly replied. Please come in. Xiu Jinyu arched his hand. Transformed into pure white and escaped into the backyard. The light dissipated. A man with a national face appeared in front of Wei Bu tired. Next second. Xiu Jinyu is moved by your beauty and has a heart full of admiration. Favorite rating plus 10. Current favorability. 70. What kind of ghost? Wei Butard's smile gradually stiffened. Isn't that the truth about not being close to women? Xiu Jinyu remained calm and composed. He smiled and arched his hand to Wei Bu tirelessly. Congratulations on successfully crossing the tribulation. Your ability to use your qi refining body to trigger the sun true fire calamity must be a hidden expert. Jin Yu dare not disturb you, and I apologize for this small gift. After speaking, he took out a stone box from his sleeve. He generously handed it to Wei Bu tirelessly. You have obtained Centennial Jinseng Asterisk 1, Chiu Jin Yu has given you a gift, and the bond between you has deepened Chiu Jin Yu's favorability towards you is plus 5. Current favorability. 75, ah. Can this also increase favorability? Wei Bu tirelessly wished he could slap his right hand. Why did you subconsciously accept it? But when Chiu Jin Yu asked with a smile, how do you address me? Wei tirelessly pondered. After years of practice, I have long forgotten the taboos in the world. Just call me a lying flat mountain person. Chiu Jinyu's eyes lit up. It is obvious that Wei Bu tirelessly refined the cultivation of the third layer as a disguise. The two of them had a friendly conversation. At the same time, outside the Qing Feng Temple, countless black shadows emerged from hidden places such as behind trees, shrubs, and stone mills. The leader's half face is covered in black scars. When speaking, the muscles tremble as if several earthworms are crawling. After being dormant for many days, we finally caught the horse's foot. The person who crossed the calamity is indeed related to Emperor Hua Qing. He is the deputy helmsman of the Xuanxuan Demon Cults branch in Yongzhou, and also the younger brother of the helmsman Gongyang, known as the Gongyang Chariot. The ram kills and stays in seclusion. His Gongyang Chariot is the leader of Yongzhou branch. Deputy Helmsman. Since we have determined that the thief is from the Huaqing sect, why don't we all step forward and take him down? There is a little brother next to me urging. Pop. The jade-faced young master holding a folding fan gave his younger brother a fierce slap. No brain. Have you seen the charred corpses outside the Qingfeng temple? The four elders are afraid to die like this. This kid is very strange. If there is a way to take advantage of the heavenly robbery, if we get a little closer, we will all die without a place to bury ourselves. The Gongyang chariot nodded and said. I also have this concern, which is why everyone has been lurking outside the observation for so long. But this time we'll step forward and we can't go back empty-handed. Don't worry about that kid for now. When Chiu Jinyu comes out, take him down first. Everyone nodded. Hide each one. Several hours have passed. There is no trace of Chiu Jinyu outside Qingfeng Temple. The people of the demon sect were eagerly waiting. However, the Gongyang chariot was extremely calm and composed. I was holding them down and didn't dare to move. 
until night falls. There was only some movement within the temple. End of this chapter. Chapter 9. Catch it all in one go. You are listening at NovelFull.audio. Chapter 9. Catch it all in one go. So, it was your excellency who crossed the tribulation here and was accidentally bumped into by people from the Xuanxuang demon sect, which led to what happened later. After listening to Wei Bu tirelessly explain the truth. Although Chiu Jinyu felt there was something suspicious. But there is no doubt that Wei Buki is lying, the person lying on the flat mountain has a dignified appearance and an elegant temperament. He doesn't look like a person full of lies no matter what. It seems that Uncle Zhong's incident was really an accident. Xiu Jinyu sighed in his heart. I didn't expect Uncle Zhong to be lurking well. But they were pulled by the insane members of the demonic cult and died together under the heavenly calamity. This is completely different from their initial judgment. Not good. We need to report this matter to the sect leader as soon as possible, in case they misjudge the movements of the Xuanxuang demon sect as a result. This is Chiu Jinyu's first thought. However, returning to the same place. He was also somewhat reluctant to part. Um. You can't be too anxious either. Uncle Zhong's body has not been examined yet. If this person lying on the flat mountain were to deceive me, wouldn't I have been caught off guard? Let me touch his reality again. Chiu Jinyu's mind twitched. I found an excuse for myself. Then he shifted the topic and engaged in intimate conversation with Wei Bu tirelessly. Setting aside the increasing intimacy caused by procrastination, let's not talk about it. Wei Bu tirelessly did not dislike Chiu Jinyu. This person, as a righteous disciple, can be said to have outstanding knowledge and extensive experience. Wei tirelessly traveled to this place without any foundation and needed a guide. The two hit it off at once. A chat lasts all afternoon. Until the dusk darkens. Underway tirelessly several eye hints. Chiu Jinyu just stood up to bid farewell. Don't worry, Your Excellency, I will definitely take your words to the sect leader in their original form. After the misunderstanding is resolved, I will come back to visit you again. Wei tirelessly forced out a smile. He only concealed the section of the Thunder Yuan Immortal Dharma from Chiu Jinyu, and the rest was the truth. In addition, he also subtly told Chiu Jinyu that his frequency of crossing tribulations would be relatively frequent. Chinya Mountain may often be shrouded in clouds in the future, which is extremely dangerous for practitioners. This is to avoid unnecessary trouble. As for whether Emperor Hua Qing would really constrain his disciples to approach Chinya Mountain. That's not Wei Bu tirelessly in charge anymore. I hope it can be quiet for a while. I have reached a bottleneck in my understanding of Feng Lei Fist, and I need to spend time tackling it. Watching Chiu Jinyu's pure white light fade away. Wei Bu tired breathed a sigh of relief. In less than half a minute. Your friend Chiu Jinyu was attacked by the deputy helmsman of the Xuanxuang demon sect, Gongyang Nian, your enemy. Your friend Chiu Jinyu has been attacked by the elder of the Xuanxuang demon sect, Wu Rui, your enemy, your friend Chiu Jinyu was attacked by Wei Feifei, your enemy, a member of the Xuanxuang demon sect just for a moment. Hundreds of messages flashed across the screen. Wei Bu tirelessly stared blankly. How many people are attacking Chiu Jinyu at the same time? Wait is this the Xuanxuang demon sect pouring out its nest? Where are they now? Wei Tirelessly's nerves suddenly became tense. He secretly glanced at Jian. Ha! Huh. Why hasn't there been any movement this time? Is it because the place where they started was quite far from the Jian? Wei Bu tirelessly bared his teeth. I don't know if Chiu Jinyu can escape. Your friend Chiu Jinyu was besieged to death Wei tirelessly shook his head. This is the cultivation world. Killing evil with righteousness and killing evil with righteousness. You're about to die. Before the completion of the 800-year thunder calamity, I'll just stay in this Qingfeng temple honestly. Glancing at the charred corpses inside and outside the wall. 
Wei tirelessly strengthened his beliefs. At this moment, a faint voice suddenly came in, Mountain people save me. It's Chiu Jinyu. Wei tirelessly jumped up the pavilion and took a closer look. Observing outside, a dim escape light was slowly approaching. Escape behind the light. And accompanied by countless blood cocoons swallowed by red light. It's the soul of Chiu Jinyu. He was surrounded and lost his physical body, probably using a secret technique to make his soul escape from his body. Between lightning and flint. Wei tirelessly deduced the origin and sequence. He didn't hesitate. Just wave your big sleeve. A newly squeezed spiritual bottle flew out. Give it a whoosh. Xiu Jinyu's remaining soul was imprisoned in a spiritual energy bottle. They're chasing after me. The remaining soul appeared to be filled with fear. It's the Xuanxuang Demon Sect. It's the Xuanxuang Demon Sect. Wei Bu tirelessly had a solemn expression on his face. The blood cocoons quickly approached. Waves of demonic energy followed one after another. In no time, the mighty members of the demon cult surrounded the Qingfeng Temple, making it impossible to escape. But they seem quite restrained. Surprisingly, they all maintain a certain distance from the wall. Wei tirelessly said that there are also experts in the demon realm. He couldn't help but breathe a sigh of relief. To the people of the demon cult. That's right. If there's anything, just say it. Don't come over, all of you. Don't take a step forward. The ram carriage paused slightly. A fierce aura surged in his heart. I'm going to take one more step forward, what's wrong? Such thoughts were forcefully dispelled by his cautious nature. No way. This kid is weird. Fortunately, I restrained myself and didn't fall for it. The feet of the ram carriage remained motionless. A cold smile appeared at the corner of his mouth. Only children can use provocative tactics. But suddenly, in his spare time, he noticed that many of the followers around him took a step forward without hesitation. Master is about to move forward, what's going on? Someone was shouting while walking. Not only did I take a step, but I also used my magic weapon. What happened? A young man offered a giant sword wrapped around countless skulls. Perceived. Boom boom. Thunder roll. The chilling sound of the ram carriage suddenly exploded above my head. Next second. The Gongyang chariot saw that the young man across from him also showed a painful expression. Tell you not to wander around. This is before the thunder completely exploded. The last sentence heard by the ram carriage. Next breath. The world is completely white. The wind and clouds are changing. The entire Qingya mountain is shaking violently. Stimulated by a large number of deeply karmic individuals and magical tools, the heavenly calamity has prematurely ended this cycle of fatigue the intensity of the heavenly calamity is continuously upgrading current heavenly calamity. Melting void fire and thunder calamity, can eliminate the spirit transformation cultivator, when incandescent light balls, like small suns, descend from the sky. Way tirelessly sighs are approaching blindness. He quickly hid under the pavilion holding the spiritual bottle. Thanks to the protection of the Thunder Emperor's talisman. He can barely withstand the damage of Rongxu Fire Thunder. But this thing also has physical damage. The impact of punches and punches on the flesh made Wei tirelessly feel unbearable pain, wow. He was hammered into spitting blood one after another. As for what happened outside. He doesn't even care. The raging melting fire and thunder washed the ground for a whole night. Stay until noon the next day. Wei tirelessly had the strength to check the results. Outside the Qingfeng Temple. Burning corpses scattered throughout the field. Hundreds of shocking kill records flooded into our eyes, you have killed Gong Yang Nian, the deputy helmsman of the Yongzhou branch of the Xuanxuang demon cult. 
His relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you, and you may face their pursuit. You have killed Wei Feifei, a member of the Xuanxuan demon sect, and her relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you. You may face their pursuit. You have killed Elder Cheng Wuyo, the deacon of the Xuanxuan demon sect. His relatives, friends, and disciples have developed hatred towards you, and you may face their pursuit. It's numb. Completely numb. There are thousands of enemies on the list. The hate list is so special that it can't fit anymore. Weibu tired covered his heart and looked at it. Those ranked 999 all have a hatred level of 80 plus. I can be said to have enemies all over the world. Achievements, you have eliminated all members of the Yongzhou branch of the Xuanxuan demon cult, except for the helmsman Gongyang who killed them. You have achieved a new achievement. Catch them all in one go. Kill all in one go. Eliminate all evil and leave no trace. You have received a reward of intelligence plus one, slay over 100 members of the demon cult and your achievement. Defeating demons and defending the way has set a new record. You have received a reward of strength plus one, add one point to each innate and acquired attribute. It can be considered as the best comfort for Weibu tired after being beaten up all night. Next up. He found that his merit value had skyrocketed by over 3,000 points. There are two more items that can be exchanged. Among them, the rainbow sword is an aggressive magic weapon. Wei Butard has little interest. The other one is quite interesting. Silver Bodhisattva Grape required merit. 2000 Function, under the mysteries, Taking it can significantly improve the proficiency of a technique Wei tirelessly tried to exchange one. After taking it, he chose to enhance the technique of looking for qi. The proficiency level of one qi technique has significantly increased, and the current proficiency level is. Transformation Realm one qi technique, Transforming Realm, has added new functions. 1. Mark a certain number of friends or enemies, and you can know what they have recently experienced or are currently experiencing. 2. You will have a chance to learn about rumors or major events in the area. End of this chapter. Chapter 10. The Emergence of Demons, Adding a Guard to the Alliance Leader's Sword. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 10. The Emergence of Demons, Adding a Guard to the Alliance Leader's Sword. The maximum number of people that can be marked by the current Qi watching technique is 10. Friends or enemies are welcome. However, after Qiu Jinyu's death, only two Taoist priests and one netizen remained in Wei's tireless friend list. There is not much value to pay attention to. He then opened the hate list. Randomly select a member of the 99 club for a peak steal, Gongyang killing. Jin Dan De Sheng, 67 years old, is the helmsman of the Yongzhou branch of the Xuanxuan demon cult, practicing the swallowing heaven and changing sun demon technique. Life history. Omitted innate destiny, crazy and rebellious, green. Arrogant and unrestrained, rebellious and crazy, adapting to the magic mind technique paranoia, green. Never die until you reach the yellow river, never turn back until you hit the southern wall, more suitable for practicing magic techniques nature is cold and thin, green. Cold and heartless, only caring about oneself, extremely suitable for practicing magic techniques. Recent experiences, in the summer of 929 in the Linghuang realm. Gongyang killing is a divine skill in the cultivation of the heaven-swallowing and sun-changing demon technique, and has been locked down since then this leader of the demon cult can only achieve the current level of success with the help of the three greens, which shows how suitable these three destiny traits are for following the path of the demon way. The good news is that both Gongyang Killer and Gu Madman are in seclusion. The bad news is that this guy is practicing divine powers. The closing time is unstable. When he came out of seclusion, he found himself alone in the entire branch. I don't know what I think. Fortunately, Weibu tirelessly has now completely exhausted himself in this regard. Love can come or not. 
Anyway, Brother Qianjie is covering up here. There is no divine weapon like the Thunder Emperor's talisman beside me. This fusion of virtual fire and thunder can even melt the divine period. Besides, the ram kills a mere golden pill. So now he is checking the basic information and network of enemies, not so much to prevent revenge, but rather to satisfy his desire for gossip, what? When Gong Yang was young, he did things like killing his father and marrying his mother. No wonder he and Gong Yang Nian are so different in age. They are both younger brothers and sons. What Lu Bei plot? This demon cultivator named Shinji always got rejected by the female cultivator because he was too ugly, which led him to escape into the demon realm in a fit of anger. Is there no such thing as a plastic surgery pill in this world? What's the use of joining the demon realm? Isn't it even uglier? The benefits of Xuanxuan demon cult are quite good. When you join the sect, you will receive a set of small apartments in the cave. Unfortunately, there are huge rats in the nest, and this elder named Kwai Quan alone occupies 130 caves. By collecting rent, you can earn a lot of spiritual stones every year. You have figured out the land consolidation scheme and deserve to be struck by lightning. Sharply commented for a while. The newly recruited members of Club 99 were finally collectively reviewed by Wei Bu tirelessly. Based on the level of threat. Wei Bu tirelessly established a key observation list. The people on the list will receive the mark of Wanchi technique. He will know in advance if there is a slight disturbance. There are five people on the current list, namely Gong Yang Killer, Li Inghua, Lu Qinyao, Lu Feiyang, and a female cultivator named He Lan Shuang, He Lan Shuang. In the middle period of the Golden Elixir, the famous scattered cultivation in the Rakshasa Kingdom, the incomplete secret script, D.K. San Pian, flowing out of the spiritual realm. Life History Omitted Innate Destiny, Loyalty, Purple Loyalty to Love, Five Senses plus Ten King of Palace Fighters, Purple Always the winner in internal multiplayer struggles of any group, Fuse plus Five Narrow-Mindedness, Gray Difficult to hold a boat in the stomach, not seeking revenge overnight Recent experiences. Omitted He Lanshuang has a younger sister named He Shuiying. And this He Shuiying. It is a Taoist priest of an elder in the Xuanxuang demon sect. This time, the Yongzhou branch has set out in full force. He Shuiying was also pulled over to assist. The result is naturally nothing. The relationship between He Lanshuang and He Shuiying seemed very ordinary during their lifetime. But after He Shuiying's death, He Lin Shuang quickly entered the 99 Club. This made Wei tirelessly lament the deep affection between sisters. I have to be vigilant again, after all, being narrow minded is not just for fun. This woman is also the king of palace battles. Even though Wei Bu tirelessly trusts Qianjie very much, I couldn't help but speculate in my heart. Just me and her can't be considered as an internal or multi-person struggle, can we? Anyway. Let's talk about it on the label. There is nothing worth noting among the remaining people. Some people may have a high level of hatred. But the strength is relatively low and not a concern. Moreover, most of the relationships between people in the demon realm are also related to outsiders or the demon realm. These people will really come knocking on the door to find their way to death. Weibu tirelessly cannot stop it. Close the endless hatred list at a glance. He changed his mood. Check out the second new feature of Chiwang Chi technique. Regional major event, Sanshan County, demons are born. New, click to view the rumor board, regional rumor board, there is a rumor in the market that a peerless demon has emerged on Qingya Mountain and its demonic power is soaring, attracting heavenly punishment. Thunderbolt Han Yuan Gui, famous Sancho. Qingya Mountain was suddenly attacked by a heavenly calamity, and I, along with several other Sancho disciples, were forced to lose my cave and have been displaced to this day. I don't know if it's a demon or not. But the power of this calamity is terrifying. 
Don't approach nearby companions. Anonymous Cultivator Kinjiushin Demon or one of the three demon ancestors worshipped by Qingming Demon Cult climbing onto the regional rumor board, you have achieved the achievement of the first appearance of a notorious name, new, the first appearance of your ominous name. Your existence began to be widely known, and your ominous name began to spread far and wide you have received a reward of, beauty plus one, have I become the demon ancestor. And. Why can a bad name enhance one's appearance? Wei tirelessly finds it amusing. Immediately. He flew out of the pavilion unconsciously. Tour around the Qingfeng temple. He couldn't help but take a cold breath, the scope of Jian has expanded again. Visible to the naked eye. All shrouded in dark clouds and thunder. As for Qingya Mountain. It's even wrapped from head to toe inside. The good news is. Wei's tireless range of activities has expanded again. The bad news is. It seems that all the scattered cultivators around here have been driven away. It's only been a month now and that's all. 800 years. Will it not swallow the entire Sanshan County? Wei Bu is a bit worried. Through chatting with Chiu Jinyu. He also has a basic understanding of the geography and influence around him, Qingya Mountain is located in Sanshan County in the southwest of Yongzhou. There is a long-standing and somewhat famous Sanshanfang city in this area. Therefore, there are many scattered practices. It is the busiest gathering place for cultivators in Yongzhou. If the scope of the calamity continues to expand. If there are subsequent incidents that harm the innocent. Weibu tirelessly will definitely feel guilty in his heart. Okay, the demon ancestor is the demon ancestor. Just let them avoid it. As of now, people who die under the calamity of heaven are not considered unjustified. The only innocent person implicated, Chiu Jinyu, was still besieged to death by the people of the demon sect. Thinking of Chiu Jinyu, Wei tirelessly took out the spiritual energy bottle. I only took a glance. He couldn't help but sigh. Chiu Jinyu is almost done. There's no way. He only had cultivation during the foundation construction period. Soul separation is achieved through the skillful use of mystical techniques. As soon as the time comes, the soul quickly weakened. Nowadays, Chiu Jinyu only has a little spiritual sense in the center of the bottle. The rest is completely gone. Wei tirelessly gazed at the bottle. The little man in the bottle is bowing to him. Wei tirelessly moved his mind. Suddenly controlling the spiritual energy bottle to fly outward, his technique of guarding objects is quite inexperienced. It can only be forcefully pushed by magic. Fortunately, the spiritual bottle was created by him using magic. Driving is relatively simple. In no time. The bottle flew out of the range of the heavenly calamity. The bottleneck is loosened. Xiu Jinyu's spiritual sense quickly emerged from inside. Quickly disappear and disappear. Thank you to the mountain people for protecting my spiritual consciousness. I have gone to reincarnation, and if we can meet in the next life, we will surely form a bond and repay it. A voice like this came from my ear. Wei Bu tirelessly nodded slightly. This guy has deep blessings. There is an opportunity for reincarnation if spiritual consciousness is not extinguished. He thought for a moment. Try to mark Chiu Jinyu with the Qi watching technique. The result was surprisingly successful. After a moment. He also added atmospheric athlete IUN to the key observation list. So far. The list reaches seven people. In the short term, Wei Bu Di will not add any more. Taking advantage of the opportunity to expand the scope of activities. He wandered in the mountains for a while. After calming down a bit. I returned to Qing Feng Temple. I have a premonition. The bottleneck of Feng Lei Fist is about to break through. Carrying such a belief. Wei tirelessly stood under the pavilion. Start practicing your fist over and over again. 
Yulong Mountain. Huaqing Sect Elite Hall. They're chasing after me. It's the Xuanxuang Demon Sect. It's the Xuanxuang Demon Sect. The mournful voice echoed in the empty hall for a long time. Inside the hall. No figure of Zuan Yangzi can be seen. Only, nine senior brother and another elder remain. This is the voice of Jin Yu before his death. The voice of senior brother Jiu contained an uncontrollable anger. It's the Xuanxuang demon sect that harmed him. The other person comforted and said. Jin Yu can still reincarnate, and we still have a chance to find him back. Before the head senior brother returns, we still need to calm down. Senior brother Jiu glanced at him. Cold channel. I naturally understand this. The leader went to Kyulongjing to calculate the time when the next generation of Tianjiao Dragon Qi was born. Jin Yu is indeed not as important as Inghua to the sect. I'll hold on to this breath. Just wait for Inghua to pass, I will definitely kill the ram to pieces. The other person nodded. Take the opportunity for a moment later. He suddenly said. But I want to know, to whom were these words spoken by Jin Yu before his death? Senior brother Jiu was slightly taken aback. Then he squinted his eyes. Thank you to the leader of the Ba Dao Reward Alliance, thank you to the helmsman of Pang Qin Reward, and thank you to the brothers for their reward and voting support. Next, the daily update time will be changed to the same as the previous book, which is 9 in the morning and 5 in the evening. I hope everyone can read and vote more, after all, reading will determine whether they can receive recommendations in the future. End of this chapter